Auto Show TV's Car Care Tips, presented by Melvin's Tire Pros, where buying tires and fixing your car is never a hassle. Here this morning with Jim Melvin at Tire Pros in Smithfield. We have some questions from the mailbag. Great. You have fans. Outstanding. <laughs> so here we go. And these are good. Uh, it seems like an alternator can go without warning. Is there anything you can do to prepare? John, that's a great question. The answer to that question is no. An alternator being an electrical item is kind of similar to a light bulb. One minute it works, the next minute it doesn't. In some cases, a battery light may come on in your dashboard, which is going to give you a warning or an indicator that you've got an issue. What I would recommend is this, particularly going into the cold weather. Swing it by one of our stores, let's load test the charging system. That's going to check the, the life of the battery. It's also going to make sure that all the diodes in the alternator are working properly and properly charging your vehicle. What about putting in a used or reconditioned alternator as some people do? Not an issue. There are some parts that we don't like to replace on a remanufactured basis just due to the success of the repair. An example of that may be like a brake master cylinder where the hydraulics can't properly be rebuilt. What we like to do is we would like to get a remanufactured alternator or starter. We have no problems with it whatsoever. Very high success replacing these without any issues. Good to know. All right, another question. Are the new kinds of air pressure tire machines at gas stations and convenience stores accurate? Well, another good question. I would certainly give them the benefit of the doubt. The moral to that story being, get your air pressure check. Just assume that the gauge is going to be good. But in most cases, I would say yes. Okay. All right, here's the last one. Since you really don't need a tune-up anymore, besides the obvious, what things should be maintained in the first 50,000 miles? Most vehicles today in the first 50,000 miles are simply a matter of fluid exchanges. Changing your engine oil, changing your antifreeze, and in some cases with antifreeze, antifreeze can last up to 100,000 miles. Brake fluid breaks down. So fluid exchanges, air filters, cabin air filters, and the most important hard part replacement under 50,000 miles is wiper blades. Particularly getting into the bad weather, make sure your wiper blades are in good shape. And you guys do this stuff here every day at Tire Pros. Absolutely, where having your car fixed and servicing your tires is never a hassle.